Apple. All right. Yo. Hey. We're live. Oh, we can't hear hey. ourselves. Oh, we can. That's fine. <clears throat> Yo, this is some good RNG manipulation. <laughs> yeah, I hear it. Yeah. Um, I'll count down. Cool. Alright, uh, before I start this run, uh, I'm Joe D'Amelio. Uh, I just really want to thank Le Hulk for all the time and everything that he's put into this game. Uh, most of the optimizations and pretty much everything is really all his work. So, uh, you know, thanks, buddy. You're the man. So, five, four, three, two, one, go. So right off the bat, you're going to notice, or you're not going to notice, a lot of really little things like jumping in certain places that kind of seem silly to jump there. It's actually to manipulate where enemies are on the screen, where they stop moving, where they spawn, that sort of thing. Uh, you'll notice that he's, uh, he's mashing the R button, or whatever button he has it mapped to, because he uses X. some Something X, X. Yeah. crazy. So normal people that aren't god gamers have the sheet map to R and uh, what mashing the sheet button does in this game is every time you open the sheet it boosts you forward like a pixel so you want to mash it as much as possible but the thing is if you're not holding the sheet then you lose vertical height so there are a few jumps in the game where you actually don't mash the sheet button so that you actually make the jump because if you mash it it's likely you won't but pretty much everywhere that's possible, you want to mash sheet so that you get that pixel boost every time you do it. And you'll notice he uh, mashes sheet uh, sometimes when landing because uh, if you don't, it kind of you lose momentum moving forward. So Aladdin um, breaks his knees. Yeah, he breaks his knees. Yeah. So if you if you spam the uh, the sheet there, he uh, keeps moving. Something else that's going to be going on throughout the run is it's really important to keep track of the gems. He has 23, 25 gems right now. And uh, when you get 100 gems, it gives you another heart and refills your heart, which is the more important thing because at the very last level, we're going to be low on them. health and you want to get that 100th gem right before the boss fight to get a free refill without having to look for one. Yo, check out Abu in this fight. <laughs> Putting up the dukes, dude. <laughs> Now, if you throw an apple at this boss here, it cancels out his uh, sword dance uh, attack there, so you can get more hits on him quicker. Dude, how dare this guy defend his shop we were stealing yeah, from? I know, right? What a jerk. Using the apples we stole from him to yeah. throw back at him. <laughs> oh, I Justice. love criminals. <laughs> Something interesting about these screens, um, when I first started running the game, I thought, like, intuitively you would want to avoid as many red gems as possible, but no. that screen takes the same amount of time, no matter how many gems you get, so it can fill all the way up, and as long as you're mashing start, it'll go away at the same time. Now, there's a lot of damage boosting in this uh, section coming up here. Whoa! Actually, it's just one. Just the one. Yeah. I'm sorry. Just the one. <laughs> just, the one. <laughs> just one. It's actually a safe strat. It's only like yeah. 20 frames slower, so. That section right there. It's rough. Not a fun section. If you miss that apple, you have a bad time. Would not recommend that section. Yeah, that first scorpion on the ground is one of the few instances of RNG in the game as well. Uh, if he moves right, it's a lot more difficult to throw that apple. Also, you saw me stand there for a second. Um, I was actually waiting for a boo to catch up to me. Because if you uh, play the cutscene as soon as you can, he's going to walk towards you uh, versus when he would run towards you if you're waiting. I thought you just forgot where the cutscene was. So I actually, <laughs> I thought you just forgot to move forward. <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> I was too. <laughs> That's a hard trick to yeah, do right there. 
if you're not on the rope long enough, you'll get stuck behind the little spire there, and you take a swim, and Aladdin's mm -hmm. no good at swimming. Nope. Whoops. Uh, don't die. Yo, good D-boost. That's actually yeah, yeah, a, yeah, a cool strat. You can get hit by the boulder there on accident and get the boost forward. Very intended. Got a auto-scroller coming up soon. Abu! No! 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 Infidels. <laughs> yeah, I can't do that. So you try, I try. Infidels. <laughs> that was bad. Sound like you smoked all your yeah, life. Yeah, that was so <laughs> Infidels. <laughs> Chocolate. That's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. thanks. All right. So this is the level that no one likes. Nope. Both because it's an auto-scroller. <laughs> Speedrunners hate auto-scrollers. <laughs> really, this is like the worst auto-scroller. Yeah. yeah. Auto-scrollers are supposed to be easy, and you have I don't to think actually. they really understood that when yeah. making this game. Because you actually still have to do stuff in this level. This is, I think, the only level in the run where getting all the red gems is... Or no, I guess the magic carpet ride. Yep. Red gems are worth three gems, and green are worth one. So getting all the red gems is good, yep. because you get more, and more is good. Yeah. It's a brilliant observation. I'm trying to keep it down on your level. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Oh <laughs> We're a team. You call We're me out. I'm going to fight a team. back. <laughs> so there are a couple of moments in this auto scroller. That one especially with the two little fireballs where if you pull out the sheet, it actually lags the heck out of the game. So you don't want to pull out the sheet. After you've died enough on this level, you kind of learn how to not have to use the sheet. Yep. Shoutouts to Hulk. Shoutouts to Hulk. <laughs> Speaking of which, we have a $40 donation from La Hulk. Hey. Yo. Yo. Hey, Hulk, what's up, dude? Believe it or not, the Disney block is the part I was looking forward to the most. Good luck to all the runners, and thanks for making this awesome event every year. Big shout-outs to my friend Josh. What a guy. He's what a, guy. What a, what a guy, that Lay Hulk. What a guy. I learned a lot from him about this game. I haven't talked to him, though. I should. <laughs> <laughs> Just met this guy like two minutes ago. I know, right? Right before the run. Yeah. No? Sorry, it's hard for me to concentrate. I just got the Super Mario Kart menu music oh, in my you? left ear. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's going I on. That too. <laughs> really? I, I don't I don't have it. <laughs> so this is a great auto scroller because you have to spend the entire time on like the right third of the screen. Or else you die. So really, the first two-thirds of the screen are just big, shiny death most of the time. Yeah, this, this level was rough for me as a kid. I don't know if anyone beat this level as Probably a kid. Probably not. I rarely saw genie levels. Yeah. So you never had a friend? No. Like him? No. Yo, nice. 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 Yeah, nice. nice. I'll, I'll clap for myself. <laughs> Far Aladdin Abu. Shout out to Ivan. Yo. Nice. Yo. All the gems. Nice. All the gems. Nice. This whole set of levels is probably, in my opinion, the most technical. It feels like Agreed. playing it. I thought I've seen the same word too. That jump he did against the bottom of the genie platform chin, it actually boosts you forward a little bit. And it's Whoops. really, really tricky to get. And if you don't, then you just face yeah. plant into these little pot birds, which is why would this is supposed to be a pleasant dream I know. or I know. trippy. This section can get rough too. At least for me. I don't it's know. It's the same every time. Well, I <laughs> No, it, it is some tough platforming. That jump right there yeah, is actually pretty I hard meant to that, do. that part of it. No, I got you. little fun fact. If you have zero lives and you do that section, it's all clouds. Yeah, it's really slow, too. Yep. Don't do it. Yeah, don't have zero lives. Yep. You also want to avoid swinging on the bottom of the balloons and basically anything as much as possible because it kills your momentum. Sometimes you obviously have to do it, but... A little stop there so you yeah. don't have to. And he and grabbed can... the pole there and pressed down immediately to let go of it.
Oh, what a jump. We have a $50 donation from Jafar Needs Glasses. <laughs> Apparently, we need some Iago love in the donations. Places towards go the distance because goodness knows GDQ needs more Michael Bolton. Hashtag Michael Bolton. <laughs> Michael Bolton. This section is the worst. A lot could go wrong. That's all I gotta say. It's the worst. The jumps on those tongues are... You gotta be precise and quick or else you miss the cycles and once the cycles are off it's just it's, a waiting game yeah. and it's no fun. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not. Got but first. Cool. <laughs> I got both of the jumps. Nice. For some re there's a re for some really odd reason, uh, there's like two jumps on those that for some reason like it just seems random that you either get it or you don't. Yeah, you I just, mean yeah, Aladdin just busts his ankle on the edge and you have to <laughs> grab it. Yeah, like Hulk himself has really looked into it and there seems to be no like consistent speed yeah. or anything to uh get those jumps reliably. So Joe's pretty good this game. Yeah. But Killa and I have better times than he does, but we felt bad, so we <laughs> yeah. figured Joe should be the one to run. <laughs> yep. yep. Congrats on the sub twenty five. Hey, thanks man. I really appreciate that. <laughs> I worked hard for it. This level's all pretty much just timing the jumps and holding forward, more or less. Like also, the rest I of think, the game. Yeah. Also, I think these levels are one of the few that are kind of not from the movie. It's in the movie. Is it? Where? It's Aladdin's Egyptian Vacation. Oh. <laughs> is that the fourth movie? It's in the first movie, dude. Oh, is it the first you. one? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Abu, I need to rewatch. It's the part where Abu has the sunglasses on, holding like the, the sun reflector. Yes. Sure. <laughs> I honestly don't remember. Do you want to run the joke into the ground a little bit more? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, this level coming up is pretty difficult and technical to do. Bunch of spikes, bunch of hoops, bunch of arrow nerds. A lot of deboosting, a lot of whoop. A lot of whoops. Oh, oh boy. Oh. All right, no more deboosting. No more. I'm probably dead, honestly. It's all right, though. Yep. Oh. Oh, oh, yeah. oh man. It's all right. <laughs> Neg, yeah, it's all good. That, that's, that's actually a really good RNG manipulation, dying yep. on those spikes right yep. there. Um, that, it's in the chain cycles. That's that actually reset. Yes. Yeah, you need the that. chain cycles yeah, yeah, yeah. set a certain way, and the aim of the arrow guys is yep. set a certain a way. So it's now. actually a lot faster to die there and mm -hmm. go back through. It's also going to make that one bird uh, towards the end of the game not troll me. Yeah. Yep. Yep. That's pretty much a guarantee. Dirty Iago. All right, this is the hardest boss in the game. <laughs> Probably should have waited until that point, but yeah. it's okay. That walk is tough. Yeah. <laughs> It's another nice thing about this game, uh, like deaths and just like bad mistakes, they really don't cost that much overall. You know, you have some speed games that just lose like minutes to one small mistake or something, but this one, pretty much your worst absolute possible scenario would lose like a minute maybe. Probably not even that, honestly. Yeah. And that would be uh, probably losing the cape for the last fight. And for, I mean, Jafar, of course, but... Yeah. Losing the cape anywhere kind of sucks. Yeah. Cape, sheet, rag. rag. What do you call it? Rag? I call it a rag. I don't think <laughs> Aladdin can afford a sheet. I always so thought I call it was a bed rag. sheet. <laughs> well. So there was that uh, 100 gem heart fill and extra heart that we were talking about earlier. The gem count for this, he wants to end the level with somewhere around 70 or so mm -hmm. gems. Yeah, like 65 to 70 is 65, good. 65 70. I say 70 because I'm bad and miss <laughs> all the other gems afterwards, so. I was waiting. Me too, I was the whole time. Is that why you kept talking at the beginning yeah. of the level? Just please don't, please don't, 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 sing, don't, 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 don't. This is my favorite part of the game. 
when all of Agrabah bands together to shoot explosives at Aladdin and Jasmine. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> They're getting away! <laughs> One. That was so unsatisfying. <laughs> <It> was. <laughs> this apple throw right here. Mm -hmm. Very, very precise. Shwing. You want a little clip there. A lot of really weird technical stuff happens like super fast in this level so there he uh he threw an apple at a specific point so that the guard with the swords would try to block it but it's high enough above the block that it doesn't hit him because if the apple hits his block then the apple disappears but if the sword guy doesn't try to block then he throws a sword i couldn't do anything there. yeah everything gets messed up so it's a super precise throw and then jumping through those spike traps it's just so much stuff happening. I know. And then you that, don't want to... That's the stair section with yep. the arrow guys yep. and the birds. There's enemy manipulation that he clearly got correct. Yep. All right, one bad move in this stage and I'm in trouble. Wow. Whoa. All right, so... I don't I know mean, how the rest of this is going to go. You got it. Because I kind of need these two hearts. Uh, maybe I could refill early. Oh. 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 Hey. Yeah. There it is. There it is. Hey, there yeah. it is. So, ideally, he would want to refill, like, yeah, after this D yeah. boost, right? Oh, boy. Okay. <laughs> nice boost. Whew. Not even going to bother with the bread. So, there's six gems here, so you yeah. want to have. Yeah, that's when you fill there. normally yeah. get to refill. Do you want to explain this? Because I. Um, I just, I, it's random for me when I get it. It's hard for me not uh, to stare at the neck of the snake in the background. Um, <laughs> so, there's, a, quick there's a quick right. kill. There's a quick kill. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so there's no quick kill for this fight, just so you know. Don't even bother looking it up, there's nothing. Yep, don't bother. <laughs> This is uh, the real way to fight him. This is the yeah, fastest basically, way. Basically, when he does the pot birds, um, if you stand under the left flame uh, a little bit, actually, you might see it now, and hit him at the peak of the jump there, you can there quick go. kill him there. Catch him in the infinite! There we go. There we go. Nice. <laughs> All the really technical, tough stuff happens like within Toward, a one-minute yeah, like, span yeah, yeah, at the yeah. end of the game. So we kind of tried to kick it in the hyperdrive. Now yeah. for the, the final fight here, uh, in the beginning he'll shoot out a lot of eggs and uh, cause a lot of... Maybe. Leg. Well, maybe. That's RNG. Maybe. RNG, there's sorry. Some, there's some really cool D-boosts right here. Yeah. Just give the snake a hug for a little while, give him some love. But the eggs still do cause uh, lag. That was my point. They do. That was my point. They do. You cut me off, but that's what I was getting at. Yeah, if uh, Snake Jafar shoots eggs, then if they're not in a desirable place, like Joel right probably... Yeah. Throw an apple at this next one if it's not off screen. Or wait. Okay. One hit. There we go. Five. <laughs> Just do whatever you feel, man. Six. Is it eight hits? Yeah. I think. Time soon. Be ready one on more. time. One more. No, I'm not going to make that. Time. Time. If that's a 17, that's cool. 1739. Three. All right. That's. That's a good, good run. run. That's good a good, good time for good messing run. up Jafar in a death. Yeah, yeah, that's good really run. nice. That's my favorite part of the whole game right here. Spoilers, it's not over yet. I know. Just wait for it. How would you? I mean, wait. Whoa! 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 Whoa. Spoilers, it's not over yet. <laughs> it's not over yet. <laughs> Another thing to mention, this soundtrack is really good for the game. Yeah. Yeah.
<laughs> this was fun. We this should nice. do like JRTA timing from now on. Just completely switch the timing of the game and have time be on the photograph that happens oh. <laughs> the credits. It's a great photo. I'd agree with that. Right? If you haven't seen the movie, you're going to get spoiled right here. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That's they they actually made the movie after this game. Did they? No. So the movie's based on the game. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> Poor Jaffer. I'm sorry I lied to you about being a prince. I know you had to do it because of that stupid law, but I love you anyway. No problem. Use your third wish, master, and zap. You're a prince again. Jasmine, I love you too, but I can't pretend to be something I'm not. I understand. GD, my third and final wish is for your freedom. Whoa. <laughs> I'm free. I'm free. Whoa. Does that feel good? Does that feel like to hit the road and see the world? <laughs> Gosh, Jeannie. I'm sure going to miss you. Me too, Al. No matter what anyone says, you'll always be a prince to me. <clears throat> I love you, man. Oh, looks like we need a new law. From this day forward, the princess may marry whomever she chooses. What a government. <laughs> Thank you, Father. I choose him, Aladdin. <laughs> Just call me Al. Okay, Al. <laughs> there it is. Time. <laughs> <laughs> this is wonderful. Come over here, guys. And now, I'm out of here. Look out, world. Here I come. This is way more fun. I know. I run on J-Cart, so I know, just... there's nothing. <laughs> Look yeah, at you the can't pictures. read anything, hey. Yeah. <laughs> so, Disney, if you're watching, just three new hires for voice actors. <laughs> I feel Whoa, whoa. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I feel good. <laughs> I'm so glad I met you. I know, it's so good with you. <laughs> Boo boo boo! Shout out to Salary Man and Boo Boo Boo. Salary Man. Are we good? Done? All right. I think so. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thank you. Thank you. We have a $30 donation from Timmit Nutchie. Yeah, that's actually really good. Job, right? Donating during the Disney block is Aladdin and Lion King were the first games I played as a kid. So glad to see that they're getting some love here. I look forward to AGDQ all year. Keep up the awesome work, you guys. We have an anonymous $30 donation. Thanks for the very quick nostalgia trip.